people of YouTube, this is Daniel, and I'm here to show you how to crash your TI Inspire CX. First, make sure you have software version, or make sure you have the operating system version 3.9.0.463. Any other version I have not tested with to make sure this would work. So make sure you have that version because this works in this version and this version only as, as of when I make this video, when I test. So now you want to create, so if you do have that version, great. If you don't, up, update your TI Inspire CX. Step one, create a new document. Step two, add geometry. Now step three, hit menu, then go to view, then turn on 3D graphing. Step four, type in garbage, type in a garbage equation. No, not even equation, actually just type in random number like that. And then hit enter. Then type in to the second box, type in a real, then go back to here, go back to the first one that says Z1, and then take your garbage equation or garbage um, um, information you put in and then delete it. Now type in Z one parentheses x comma y now this will crash your inspire if you hit enter it will or you go up or down because either way it's going to crash make sure you've saved all your work before you've done this because you won't be able to recover it if you if it crashes when you hit it. I suggest you hit escape and save all your work and do all the all the stuff again with your work saved. Then so I'm going to give you some time to do that, let you guys save your work. So go ahead and you pause this video. Okay. So I'm assuming you've saved all your work and you're ready to make your uh, CX Inspire CX crash. Now all you have to do is just hit enter. And that's how you make your TI Inspire crash. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. And leave a comment below if you have one. And now again, I'll see you in the next one.